guys, Blue Yoshi here, and welcome back to Super Mario Galaxy! Last time, we collected all the purple coins here in the engine room, and today, we are going through out of the garden and collecting the three final purple comments that there are to do there. So, if you're excited for this episode of Super Bye bye Galaxy, please give this uh, episode a like, share with your friends, and subscribe if you want to see more. In addition, I'm here with my brother, Micah, today. Yeah, Micah! He's going to be commentating with me as we go into part 39 of Super Mario Galaxy, so. This is going on. <laughs> Alright, so um, I actually, uh, this is a very interesting uh, thing about this episode. Uh, you may notice that uh, I already have 120 stars. <laughs> And I already finished all of these comments, so you may be asking, well, what's going on there? Well, you see, um, I accidentally, uh, kind of recorded a video and uploaded it to YouTube, but I, well, that was an accident, you know, I uploaded it to YouTube, so it's on there for, like, a few, like, hours, <laughs> and then I noticed that something went terribly wrong with the recording. So, uh... Yeah, there's like the second where it was like all like glitched out and stuff. So I was like, well, shoot, I need to redraw that. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> so that's oh, what's going yeah, on. Now. I've seen that too. I did see that. So. I do watch this video. Yeah, but bro, Micah, you know, is getting in there for the long haul. You know, so definitely, guys, it's much appreciated if you guys, you know, watch the entire videos. What matters in YouTube, actually, is watch time, not subscriptions. So, you might just subscribe and then, you know, not watch the rest of the videos. That's not helpful, is what people don't realize. I mean, to an extent, it's helpful because if you subscribe, then other people think it's normal to subscribe, so then they subscribe, you know, just people theory, but you get what I'm saying, just a subscribe, like a subscription in itself is doing too much. If you're not actually, a, you know, having the content being fed to you, if that makes sense. But, anyways. <laughs> 50, 56 purple coins. Yep, 57, 58. A little yeah, behind on my counting. I did, did do this while I was watching my first. Can we just mention how much the great this music is for a second? Yeah. It uses the motif of a uh, gusty garden galaxy, which to an extent is the motif of Super Mario Galaxy. Uh, if there's any music theory buffs like I am out there. Uh, oh shoot. Um, that's gonna be a problem, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, that's a problem. We didn't have to get that. Uh, I do actually have to get every single one. Or else the robot straight up like kills me well, then you'll with his magnet. Kill himself if you do that. Well, I know, but out of time's sake, perhaps. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter because you get one up sometimes, you know? Yeah. Yeah, like right here, it's basically a free one up, so we don't have to worry about, you know, losing anything. Unless we're just being stupid and dying before, you know, we even get like 10 purple guards, which is not gonna happen, but. Uh, yeah, so. Let's, let's get this going, I right yeah. too. You spin me right round, baby, right round. Da -da 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 -da. I forget how that song goes. Surprisingly, because I've sung that song so many times in Selby, you'd think that I would know that song by now, but alas, it's out of my comprehension. Alright, uh, I need a few of these purple coins here. Grand total 46 right now. Oh boy. The thing is, you can't mess up once in this, or else you're gonna be behind by just that, like, sliver of a second, and if you're behind by anything, uh, it's gonna be a major problem in this particular, uh, purple coin mission, so. Yeah, it's not good. You just can't get hit by a single one of these bars, unless it's at the very start. You can recover from it at the very start, but once you get into, uh, the more technical side, like right here, well, you're already, you know, sort of behind if you, know, if you all going, you know, max speed and everything. Uh, oh, shoot. Oh, shoot, no. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, that, that one's difficult, too, because you have to, you know, jump into that, so. You need to have patience for that one individual part. But... Patience. That's right. Soul. Right, good. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. do have some ball cannons yet again. You have to wonder why they're shooting. I think these are supposed to be like some sort of beach ball rockets. 
I'm not exactly sure what these are supposed to be, but um, I can appreciate the originality because it's definitely not something that I've seen in any other game. No, so. Props to Bowser! You may be trying to kill us, but you're trying to kill us originally. So, props to you, man. Really appreciate the hard work and dedication Amy you put to making your schemes to Amy save the princess. Kill the princess. Not kill the princess. Kidnap the princess. Kidnap the princess. What am I talking about? Bowser's ain't killing the princess for sunny time soon. If anything, it's trying to mail your Mario Odyssey. <laughs> By the way, on the topic of Mario, Mario Odyssey, uh, so uh, people have been asking me uh, what my next series is, and I have a lot of series in the running that I'm currently thinking about. I'm not gonna be releasing exactly what I'm going to be doing just yet, and oh shoot, that's another death. But, um,. Mario Odyssey is one of the things I'm looking at, and the big thing that you need to realize is that we do have a budget here on the Blue Yoshi Gammon right here, so, uh, you know, being able to afford a Switch and Mario Odyssey, you know, it's not as much as you, like, well, not as much, it's more than you would think, and, you know, when you only make so much money per month, and that's not even off of YouTube, that's from doing, like, chores and stuff, that's... YouTube ain't making me any money that's noteworthy, you know, so... Yeah. <laughs> the point is, is that I have a, you know, confined budget, and, you know, it's possible that I might be able to find room in there for, uh, Nintendo Switch, yes. You know, Nintendo Switch definitely is gonna be a big thing that I'm gonna be wanting to invest in shortly, because there's a lot of games I do want to go over in there, you know? Uh, Splatoon 2 being one, uh, another one being obviously Mario Odyssey, you know? Being Mario Kart Day Deluxe, maybe for a video or two, who knows? But you, <laughs> you guys know what I mean. That the Switch definitely is becoming more and more prevalent as you know, prevalent or yeah, as time goes on. So I, I, I do want it, but my budget is yeah, it's, it's difficult. It's difficult. I'm gonna have to be planning around that as time comes. So yeah. Otherwise. But the Wild is still going to be uh, two times a week, as always. Uh, it, it, whenever we start, you know, our next series, it... Oh, come on! Come on, game! That's actually stupid. Okay, well... <laughs> no, uh, what I was saying is that no matter what, you know, series happens next, all I can truthfully say is that Worth of the Wild is still taking that two times a week uh, slot, and whatever it is that's coming next is just gonna be one time a week, so. Yeah. As for, like, Smash Hard Board, that is something that I've been wanting to do, sort of. But the thing about Smash is that I kind of don't see myself in it. As in, obviously, I'm very good at Smash, and I, you know, like to practice the game. Don't get me wrong, I love that game. But the thing is that. You know, whenever I make a guide for, I don't know, any character, I just feel like, you know, you could look up a better guide from, you know, so many other more credible sources and just get, you know, better information than anything I could tell you, you know, better edited, uh, better scripted, even like, I don't know, just better in every respect. So, sometimes I just... You know, wonder why when it comes to, you know, the Smash Hard Mode videos and stuff. Because when it comes to... <laughs> when it comes to these Super Mario Galaxy Breath of the Wild Let's Play videos, you know, I have my own original content that's being poured into it because, you know, it's me talking over everything. You're not gonna find that anywhere else, uh, and unless you do, that's... That'd be interesting. L link me to that if you can find me talking. That's not Blue Yoshi Gaming or the Nintendo. Uh, I'd be very interested in that. But you know, it's it's my original content. You know, so yeah. So, anyways, uh, I actually did want to talk about some copyright stuff. So, um, <laughs> lately, now again, I tell you, I do not make money off of these videos. Well, I make money. But I don't make money, if that makes sense. I make money, but I don't make any money to be able to make money with. <laughs> so, you know, like maybe like a dollar a month if I'm, you know, doing well. <laughs> so, yeah, it's not very good. 
And obviously that's not a big problem for me if everything gets copyrighted, but it is just slightly annoying when you upload, you know, a video like Breath of the Wild. Like, all my videos are being copyrighted all of a sudden. For like, no reason. It's like beforehand they weren't being copyrighted, but now they're copyrighted. And it's like just off of stupid stuff. Like, for a second I would stop talking. <laughs> and then, you know, Nintendo copyrights me for using its soundtrack. It's just... That was like literally a second of me taking a breath, you know, that's... It doesn't count, Nintendo, that doesn't count. Can't really stop that, you know what I mean? So, I mean, I don't know, I don't know. It's, it's all on how you perceive it. For, but for me, it's just plain annoying because if I ever do, you know, care about making this stuff, you know, and if Nintendo is so, you know, picky on how they want to deal with their copyright, I mean, in the future, it may actually be a problem, so... Yeah, that's all I have to say on that note, and um, I'm just going to quickly go over here. There is a slingshot? I'm actually very curious as to where that goes. I've actually never used it, but um, better to be safe than sorry. So, uh, yeah, that will be our first star. Ooh, this is right here in episode 39 of Soup! Bye -bye, Galaxy. So this is gonna be like a Glaze Star episode because we already did the Yeah. But like This episode kinda of falls in a gray area of this LP, you know? Yeah, the like graveyard of those rocks. The graveyard of those rocks. I don't think this is a graveyard. Well it's a it's a color. And if it was that would actually be very off putting in consideration well, of the blue skies in the background. Gray, the rocks are gray and that's gray too. Alright, so I think this next one is very non-intimidating as for the fact that it's actually very easy. There's no time limit to anything, it just takes a while because, you know, you need to look at everything. So it will be like the Camilla area right here, but again, I've done this so many times as to the point where I kind of know where everything is at this point. So. It's just going to be me monologuing the entire episode is really what it is. I actually did this once and I was pretty good at it. Welcome to the galaxy! Welcome to the galaxy! I can't hear the game right now, so I don't know if I'm off or not. But, um... Well, I mean, like, I can hear the game, but, like, not very well, you know, so... Because the thing is, if I turn the game up really loud, then you can hear the game louder than you can hear me. Which, in the editing phase, makes things a whole lot more difficult and, you know, all of that shows. Hey, the spin actually does work like a magnet. Isn't that useful? It's pretty handy. Do to Claire. Alright, oh, that's already 13 coins. I was gonna say, 13 coins, that's, that's kind of a n bad number. Not a bad number, but unlucky number. And I don't like the unlucky numbers, so let's quickly make that into 14. Uh, so yeah, <laughs> otherwise, for like the rest of my video stuff, um, if you know me in real life, you know that I'm the leader of this thing called the Nintendos. Which is all, you know, tournaments and, you know, dealios, you know, tournaments and everything. I'm sure, I'm sure that if you watched Blue Yoshi Gaming 64, that you would be well acquainted with, you know, what exactly that is, you know, so. Anyways, we host Smash tournaments, we host uh, three majors a year, uh, which are Smash singles. Uh, and then we host uh, varying number of uh, minor tournaments, which can be anything from Yu-Gi-Oh! to uh, Smash Doubles to Mario Kart. So, yeah, we do a wide variety of things on our tournaments. But anyways, the Nintendos is like the inner circle of players and everything. So, yeah, speaking about them, uh, we actually all... Uh, Thinking of doing some live stream stuff, actually, here in the near future. Of course, this is just, you know, a work in progress, as live streaming does take quite a bit of effort to do, but, um, yeah. <laughs> live stream, we're looking at it. I'll let you guys know if there's, if we do have any plans for a live stream in a video coming up, so, of course, make sure that, you know, you check your subscription feed, see if I have a video titled, I don't know, like, li live with the Nintendos or something. I just I wish I could do that long jump. Oh yeah, like doing a long jump in real life would just be cool. Well, not in real life. Just to see. Oh, okay. But anyways, so uh, yeah, live streams. That's that's something that we're doing. Uh, in addition, uh, another thing that 
I was going to talk about was Winter Warfare 2017. Uh, Winter Warfare 2017 was our uh, first major of 2017, uh, so our first Smash Singles 1v1 tournament of uh, this year is on April 29th. And uh, it was <laughs> it's a tournament. We got like 16, uh, 16 of you know probably the best players in this area. You know, it's just played for a while. You know, and um, as for like the places and everything, it's definitely a very interesting tournament. There's a lot of you know upsets and everything. But anyways, as for like what's going on with that tournament, I do intend on uploading it. Um, I do intend on uploading it very. Soon that just the thing is, you know, it's already it's already July, almost August, you know, and August is yeah, yeah. So it's almost you know the next major, you know. So yeah, and I'm behind, but mainly that was because I did we had to redo a few uh, bits of commentary, and not just that, but there's also like, and why is how would you get that purple coin? I know. Oh shoot, did I fail? Yeah, I failed. Shoot. Uh, well, that worked out. Anyways, <laughs> uh, as I was saying, uh, we're kind of behind with that because of all the commentary and stuff that we had to redo in that tournament. Um, but Winter Bowl Fail, it is coming up uh, on the Nintendo's channel. will be, you know, premiered on Blue Yoshi Gaming as well if you guys want to check that out. It's a great Smash tournament. Very epic, you know, there's, with consideration with everything that's been happening, you know, the last two years, there's been, you know, a lot of rivalry matches, uh, there, there's even this, this, like, rival match between, uh, Matt and Jack, or Shockwave and Septic, that actually happened, I'm not sure if I'm gonna turn it into a video or not, but, that wasn't even a rival match, that was just a really awesome close match, but, Anyways, point is, there's a lot of upsets, there's a lot of close matches, there's a lot of good stuff here on the Nintendo's Winter Warfare 2017, so if you want to check that out, you know, definitely check it out when I upload that, it's hopefully soon. It's not just 2017. Well, it is 2017. Winter Warfare 2017. It is in the Winter year Warfare. of 2017. Winter Warfare 2016. Well, that was last year. Yeah. And that was named Blizzard 2. Because the name Winter Warfare just happened this last year. But, uh, anyways, I'm gonna. Uh, there is the ones out of water, but I'm gonna get everything above water before we do that, and then we're gonna dive. How about that? Alright, um, was there actually anything over there? Uh, they might have, but, uh, anyways, as I was saying, so Winter Warfare, that's definitely something. Uh, hopefully, I'll be able to uh, upload it before. Uh, before the tournament in August, August 12th is when we're having our next major. We already have several people registered for that. So, um, yeah, it's going, it's going rather well, but, yeah, <laughs> that's all, that's all I really have to say, uh, for Winter Warfare, but, you know, Tsunami 17, we have a lot of good things going for that as well, of course, you know, with Winter Warfare and all the really close matches that happen there, there's a lot of, there's a lot of, you know, rematches that people are wanting to do, and, you know, a lot of, you know, just people asking, you know, who would win, you know, between these two, because, you know, we're moving to an age where, you know, the best players sometimes are not the best players, and they're, you know, losing to other players who are becoming the best players. You know, it's definitely a big time of change like right now, me. and the Nintendo's and like our tournaments and everything, but... Anyways, that will be our 100th purple coin heal. And our so yeah, that's <laughs> that's all I had to say about our tournaments and everything. We did have a Yu-Gi-Oh tournament uh, the other day. And it's also so that was something. Also, our, um, our 19th, 19th one Yeah, yeah, this is our 119th star, I believe. Yeah. yeah. Anyways, <laughs> so. Yeah, that's all I really had to say about the Nintendos and our tournaments and whatever, but, um... Yeah, let's see. Whatever topic can I talk about for a while for this upcoming Melty Morton Galaxy? Because we all know that that's definitely gonna be, um... Something. 
<laughs> as you know, Melting Molten Galaxy has always been known as uh, difficult. You know, if, if you watched that episode, I think that was like what episode 30, I think. Yeah, that was episode 30 when I did the Melting Molten Galaxy. That took quite a while, and I speed things up actually for like a bit of the episode. But uh, yeah, so we hot purple coins. That will be our mission right here. The mission to end all missions here on Super Mario just Galaxy. Saying, this is only just that area. Okay, I need to put like beast mode intense, like beast mode engaged, like right now, because this is a very difficult star. But it's a very fun. It's been, it's been hard for me. It's been one of the most challenging, but you know, that's good because I do like challenging stars because it makes it. You know, it makes Mario seem less Mario and more, um, difficult, I suppose. Like, what's, what's the opposite of Mario? Like, um, Kaizo? Kaizo Mario? Maybe? Maybe we could say, like, maybe we can make a parallel between Super Mario Bros. like, 1 and the Lost Levels. Do that. What is, like, two things that, that are, like, in common, but, um, one's, like, Five times as difficult as the other. Um, okay, anyways, back to the topic. <laughs> At and so yeah, that's the whole deal with our oh, tournaments and that. It's lava. Don't want to touch that. In fact, you know we should be melting right now because there's like lava pillows, and somehow we're not dying. No, I don't know how it works, but I'm not even. That's what I was gonna say. I'm not even gonna question it, but I just did, so I don't know what I'm talking about. Oh, but okay. This spot right here. You know, how sick would it be if I actually, like, beat this level without dying? That would actually be cool. Because for reference, I've had to beat this game several times for this playthrough. You know, just to get a feel for every star and, you know, to try to make it, you know, less of me messing up and more, you know, just me not messing up for this playthrough. So, I've definitely done this star a few times and... There hasn't been many times where I haven't, or where I have been able to, you know, beat it, and beat it once. In fact, I don't think I've been able to beat it once without, like, dying at least once, so. Who knows? Who knows? This may be the time that my dreams come to fruition. Or it might not, because I just touched fire there, and that's not a good thing. Alright. Uh, continuing on, everyone. We are at 60 bubble coins as of now. Um... Yeah, yeah, that's... Yeah. All I want is just to listen All right. to this music. This is good music. It's not great music, it's good music, though. But, um, yeah. Why oh, is that, like, a planet over there? I don't know. It's like a planet. Oh, by the way, so I did want to talk a little more on the Nintendos and uh, tournaments, because uh, if you guys don't know, I do all the statistics for uh, all tournaments. And, you know, I, I single-handedly, you know, up edit and upload all the videos and everything. So, you know, I have a uh, large say in this and I can kind of memorize all this. But um, I was doing the uh, averages for this year and, you know, what rank everyone currently is by statistic and what uh, the Nintendos think. So, you know, me, Alex, Matt, Jack, uh, which would be Kavato, HZL, Septic, and Shockwave. Yeah. Uh, and what we think, you know, versus, you know, how, how they compare. You know. Of course, they take up, like, different things, like, one... Yeah, like, for example, for the Nintendo's ranking, you know, it counts, like, we definitely take in consideration the very notable wins of, uh, as of late, you know, if... Uh, so, if there's, like, a very notable win that someone had, like... For example, this guy named Storm the Boy, who sort of uh, kind of destroyed this last tournament. Um, you know, he he might be getting a better lab than the statistics may be saying, you know, because of, you know, how, you know, that all works and everything, you know, because it is counting all of 2016, and then also, in addition, going into 2017. So, of course, as time progresses, it will get more and more accurate, but, yeah. Um... That will actually be all of them. I think that was one. Yeah, that was one go. If I just cannot die. 
Oh god. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. It's no no issue, I can I can get over there. I can get over there without taking a single hit of damage. How about that, game? I can get over there without getting touched. Mm. Take that game. Eat it. You game who have been saying this entire LP is like, hey, I'm, I'm, go I'm going to make stupid stuff blow up into you in the middle of the video. And you scream really loud so all the viewers make it funny. But no. Finally, I get my revenge for this game, everyone. <laughs> Feels so good. Anyways. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, subscribe if you have enjoyed the video. Comment if you have anything to say. Show, show with the friends and I'll see you next time on Super Mario Galaxy. And I'll see you then. See you guys.